Happy month of love to you and yours. Let me know how you're doing in the comments down below. Listen, my legs are like swollen from all the walking. Like, I swear to God, I think we took more steps today than any other day. Just check that out. Like, we literally took 5,000 steps today. I hope you can see that. Yeah, okay, 6,000 is updated. We took 6,000 steps today. That's how much we walked. Like, I don't think you realize how big the mall is until you're walking around from corner to corner to get to specific places and looking for things and all that stuff. Anyways, went to Pick and Pay and Woolworths. I don't know if we went anywhere else. Yeah, Pick and Pay and Woolworths. Went to Pick and Pay and Woolworths. So I'm just going to unpack everything that we got for February's grocery haul. It's a lot. We are loaded. And let's go. All right, so I'm going to start with the Pick and Pay and then end with Woolies. So the first bag that we have, listen, when we went to pick and pay, I was so stoked because I had researched online because I was looking for frozen fruit because I want to make smoothies. It's hot. Their packages of smoothies and everything is, is, is lit. Like I was so happy when I got there. So we bought some green smoothie blend. So I got like four packets. I, I went ham. Listen, I went ham. They were like 60 bucks. And compared to other places where they have frozen fruit and stuff like that, this is the most variety that I actually saw. So shout out to Pick and Pay for doing that. So this one has melon, pineapple, avocado, and cucumber. And they say you can just put everything in the blender. Add water, milk, juice, coconut, or almond milk, and blend until smooth. I cannot wait. I really cannot wait. The next packet... Jesus Christ. <sighs> Anyways, the next packet of the blend is the orange smoothie blend. This one has pineapple, mandarin, carrot, and ginger. So same applies. You just add milk or water or anything that you want to add. Put it in the blender and it does all the work. I love that. I think the only thing I will add is the protein powder, which is somewhere in these bags. I will show you because we've been working out and yeah. You're always tired, so you need some replacement for protein. So this is the red blend smoothie. So this one is banana, strawberry, cherry, and beetroot. I love everything in this. I just, I love the blend. It's beautiful. I just love it. And then of the frozen fruit, this one is the whole, ber whole blueberries. So this is just blueberries. So if I want to make like a blueberry smoothie, I will just put this. But this one doesn't have like bananas and all that stuff. I usually like to put banana because it makes like any smoothie so tasty without you adding any sweeteners or anything like that. So I'm, I'm really stoked. Really shout out to Pick and Pay for having us sorted. They had pineapple. They have so many blends. I just, I wanted to take everything. I wanted to take everything. I swear to God. The next thing that we bought were broccoli florets. The frozen version. This is like what? How many kilograms? Like a one, one kilogram. I can't wait to, you know, grill, bake and all the good stuff when it comes to broccoli. Just to make it nice and tasty. Just to really make it nice and tasty. Alright, so we're done with this bag. So we also managed to buy some mixed veg. The McCain. This is my go-to. Any shop really has this blend and I love it so much. Alright, so moving on to the second bag. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you, babe. I, I, I have my husband helping me pack as I'm doing this because it's so hot everything yeah everything is melting everything is melting right now so the next thing that we bought were some okra braivors please my Afrikaans is terrible it's non-existent actually let me just not lie so this is the bulk vors so I haven't got, gotten like worse like this. I like the way it comes packed nicely without you having the braai one. Because when you're braying, you just, you know, put it on the braai. But sometimes when you pack it, it's easy to just have a pack like this. Even if you're braying, this is so convenient. Everyone just gets the same amount of burvos on their plate. And it works out. All right. Next. When it comes to 
the meat. Uh, so we bought two five kilograms of chicken from Pick and Pay. Listen, Pick and Pay, <laughs> this is our thumbnail, right? <laughs> thumbnail vibes, right? <laughs> oh yeah, he's also a YouTuber. So yeah, we're, this is, we're, a, content, we're a content house. Thank you, baby. Yeah, I can hold him. So huh? speak about them. I can hold him for you. All right, so... <laughs> Go on, go on, go all on. right, all right, I'm going on. So the two packets of the five kilograms of chicken is gonna last us for a while. The, we didn't buy too much like red meat or anything. We eat a lot of meat so that we don't have to eat a lot of carbs because you know the weight loss situation and everything else it's been working so the chicken is gonna be here for a minute. I think the five kilograms last for about two weeks if I'm not sure between the two of us. So yeah, that's a lot of meat and I'm here for it. Oh, why is everything so heavy? I'm so tired. And this morning I did like Taibo in the morning. Oh, so we bought some super maize meal for some pup. Listen, pup, you don't actually gain so much weight compared to white rice. I swear to God. Well, because I only eat this much. But yeah, I, I don't know what happens with white rice. If there's like more carbs, if there's a nutritionist that watches these videos by some coincidence, please explain that whole process because I literally thought pup makes you gain more weight compared to white rice but I think it also depends on the portions please let me know in the comments down below because yeah your girl doesn't know all right uh in this packet wait. I'll just wait for continue. you continue all right so in this packet we've got some cheese rations okay I can't do it <laughs> It's too much noise, baby. It's too much noise. We bought some cheese rations, so I'm pretty excited for them. I haven't had rations in a minute. So I'm pretty excited. So when it comes to the diet that we're on, we're trying to eat less processed food, but try to balance out when you miss it. When we saw the rations, we both looked at each other and we knew it was going to happen. So bought some cheese rations. Ooh, they're almost like cheese bangers, right? Yeah. Anyways, let me move on with the bowl so that I don't waste more of your time. Now this bag, I am excited for what I managed to, you know, bring about. Shout out to Pick and Pay for having charcoal tortilla wraps. Like when I saw them and then I saw what you could do with them, all I saw is how I can make them pop. Because black is such a clean canvas, you literally have room to work around and do whatever you want. It has 3% activated charcoal, which made the whole color. I know who was recently, uh, you know, introduced like wraps. I, I forgot to get the, even look for the wraps. So yeah, this time we're going to have to do with the, with the, look at how huge that is. It's like bigger than my face. Or is it the same size? I don't know. But yeah, we got the large brown tortilla wraps. I feel like with these type of wraps you can put more because in these ones you can't really put that much in them it's like you are limited when it comes to space so yeah compare the two side by side i think i'm gonna be going for these shout out to pick and pay for that all right next on the list that I, did i even follow my grocery list well i did to 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 a point i did and yeah don't worry everything that i bought i always have a grocery list in the description so check it out as you want to take a screenshot or anything like that so we bought some couscous i love me couscous couscous is like the easiest thing that you can make you just add hot water you put it on the side and then it cooks by itself saves so much time next thing that we bought was some oris black pepper it's a grinder refill Mm -hmm. talk about grinders keep a lookout for a new video because your girl got new grinders from Le Creuset Ooh, yeah it, we'll talk about it in that video uh so oryx black pepper so we've got we we'll show them a little bit oh oh yeah the 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 yeah i want some grinders from Le Creuset i entered a competition on instagram and Lo and behold, I, I, I scrumped my scrumped. It was so loud. My husband was like, what the hell is going on? And yeah, so I won two of these uh, Le Creuset um, salt and pepper shakers. I think they're like worth like one point something. And I was like, you know, once you, 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 you buy the one, because my husband bought me the one for Christmas. And then Le Creuset was like, Valentine's Day. Valentine is coming. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so the paper is for that. I think I'm rambling on for too long. Uh, next thing that we bought were some chicken cubes, like for stock, ch chicken cube stock, chicken stock cubes. Yes, anyways, stock for chicken. 
uh, we have that. I love adding stock to like even my couscous. Instead of just adding water, then I'll add stock. The flavor is amazing. And managed to also buy some Himalayan crystal salt. I was going to buy the fine one, but then I saw this packet and I was like, you know what? It works because of the grinder. So I can't wait to put it in the grinder and see how that works. And bought a lot of beans, a lot of grain. Like, yeah, grain is like my favorite, my favorite. I managed to buy some white kidney beans over here. I love me some white kidney beans. They are amazing. And I got so excited because they also had black eyed peas. <laughs> they had black eyed beans. So yeah, I got excited for that. And yeah, they cook more or less the same way as you would like black beans or any other beans, which is why I love beans so much. Can you tell I love beans so much? We got like three types of beans. So we got, we bought the red speckled beans as well. We top of the white ones. And then some green split peas. We eat a lot of grain in this house and it makes a whole lot of sense and then we also bought some shoulder bacon for the wraps and the russians are also for the wraps and green stuff also for the wraps and now moving on because i am just talking about many many things okay i'm just checking if there's still any pick and pay bag no okay so on my way out of pick and pay they trapped me okay they trapped me because i've been looking for side plates and little uh balls like for you know for like any breakfast or anything sometimes you don't want to use like a large plate for small things and pick and pay was the plug okay pick and play was the plug. yeah this is the receipt from this from this pick and pay because as we we're going out we already paid so then we had, i had to go back in there again look at how pretty these balls are and they were going for 39.99 can you believe it for like 40 40 rand they are perfect for cereal for like smoothie balls anything anything can really work here you're having pop whatever that you want to have it definitely works so we bought two of each i'm just trying not to take things out that because the lady at the teller was like be careful how you're gonna unbox everything because it might break in the car or anything like that and the little dots that are on there the texture is so beautiful and i love like the matte finish it's not like too shiny or anything like that 40 bucks i was like yeah because the other stores like your home choice or even woolies and stuff like that for you to get something like this it would cost you a lot like these are so pretty the texture like i'm just thinking besides you just eating like i make food content and this would look so amazing any food in there the texture like inside it almost feels like you can feel these dots that are inside it's almost like it's dented but it's not because it's like so smooth and it's matte i love it so much okay so the plates and then the balls oh i'm so happy <laughs> Okay, let me put these on the side. All right, now we're moving on to everything we, got, we bought from Woolies. Earlier on, I was talking about the whey powder, the whey, the whey powder, yeah. So the whey powder for the smoothies or for the oats and everything. I'm sure it's like blown up right now, but it's literally just powder. It's whey powder. What's in it? Yeah, it's just whey powder, natural colorant and salt. So very, very amazing for smoothies or for oats or for pancakes or anything of that nature. And then we also managed to buy some, what is it, whole wheat spaghetti made from whole durum wheat. I'm not an expert on wheat, so I'm sure it's good, right? So, yes, so the whole wheat pasta is also there. I'm loving that for variety. And then over here, we bought like a refill for our dishwashing, for our dishwashing liquid. Uh, second time trying the, the Woolies brand and I actually really like it compared to sunlight because what i noticed is whenever we move dishwashing liquids and we move from sunlight sometimes you end up using more thinking that you are saving so you always come back to sunlight because it does the it does a good job and this brand for woolies does does amazing and also bought some butter chicken curry i love the spice so much i love the spice so much it's like a it's it's packed with everything that you need and i love that you can use it for more than just chicken you can use it for any other type of meat that you will be eating. I love that so much. And in here, we have some long life cream, long life full cream milk, two of them for the smoothies. So they're a special for three of these. For three, yeah. Uh, save three, buy for 80. So they had some medium potatoes. Always good to have some potatoes around. 
and then they had some brown onion the brown onion yes there's some brown onion over here also part of the special if i locate the third thing i think it's squash because i picked squash there was butternut well they are both squash right but yeah uh, one of these bags is uh oil so i'm just trying to be very very careful yes the third part of the special was squash i love squash because i usually just stuff it with things like couscous or whatever else that i managed to just mix up it's one of those lazy meals that you can just cook and you'll be good and then we bought some roma tomatoes these are perfect for stewing and all that good stuff i usually just use them for my one pot meals with chicken or whatever stew that i'm making and last but not least in this bag there is some mixed peppers I wanted the other papers, the colore papers, but then the expir expiration date was literally like tomorrow. So I cannot have that. I once dropped a bottle of avocado oil and it was halfway. Yeah, my heart stopped. That oil is not cheap. And it was the bigger bottle. Oh, it's discontinued the one liter of avocado oil. I've got beef. I want to know why, but it's fine. <laughs> All right. In this packet, in this bag, we bought some mixed leaf salad. Like, yeah, we are rabbits. <laughs> we eat the food that our food also eats. <laughs> but yeah, we have we bought some mixed leaf salad. I love this because you get all the leaves in one so that your salad is interesting and it's not boring. As you would say, because you know, anything that is deemed healthy is like, how can we make it exciting? Like, no, just eat it like that. Anyways, uh, we bought some avocado oil, so this is the 500 milliliter, so I had to, we had to buy two so that to make the one liter, because when I make salads and all that stuff, I find maybe sometimes this doesn't last the whole month, depending on how much I'm using the oil, and being very careful. The other bottle of the avocado oil, so we have the two bottles up here to make the one liter. I don't know if they have the two so that you pay more, I have no idea. I've been trying to look for avocado oil. I checked for it in pick and pay. Please let me know if there's avocado oil in pick and pay. I was just seeing olive oil of which I cannot cook with it. So yeah, mm, I'm excited for this. We bought some Dijon mustard. I've been wanting to, you know, have my own Dijon mustard so that I can make my own salad dressings because, you know, I get to control what's in my salads. I know mayonnaise is good, but the Dijon mustard, yeah, it's, it's the one. I'm really excited for it because all you just add usually is salt, pepper. You can make so many combinations of salad dressings. Someone asked me if I can do a video of like different salad dressings. I'll see what I can do because I know sometimes eating salads without flavor just, it doesn't. It's not giving. It doesn't do that. That thing you don't want to eat whilst you don't enjoy the food. So yeah, making your own dressing is amazing. So I had to go all out with the... Um, chutney sauce we usually buy the smaller bottle this is like 1.1 kilograms this flies like i don't think it lasts two weeks when it's the smaller bottle because i use it in my shoes and for the food and for the meat and all that stuff it's so delicious and you can add it to so many things and make so many recipes and i even use it for topping for salad and stuff like that all right we have some double yogurt double cream yogurt here that we bought thick and creamy perfect for the smoothie situation that we got i've been seeing a lot of recipes with orzo i was like what what is orzo because it looks like rice but it's not rice it wants to be rice but it's not rice so this is one is traditional it's a traditional italian recipe uh yeah so i'm excited to make it so yeah basically the same way you would make pasta same 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 way because the first time i had it in rest i was like what is this it's so nice then i keep seeing it in recipes i'm like no it's orzo orzo i've heard that before then i saw it in woolies i was like ah and guess what it was like 20 something bucks i thought it was gonna be more expensive than that so i'm pretty excited for orzo so keep a look out for my recipes oh my god i almost forgot these because my husband was like you forgot something all right so we bought two half and as uh, chocolates that we wanted to try but they melted because we took so much time so this is the belgian flavor so we just took two flavors just to try it and i like and i love that they are like this tiny i hope they're showing I don't yeah know. they're showing well they're showing well i normally showing wear great. glasses so yeah everything is a blur i just i just got tired of wearing them and just wanted to come out with a so this is the vanilla flavor and this is the hacken chocolate flavor i just thought maybe we wait until they refreeze again nah, they... i want to try it now okay 
They're not. I literally, bro wanted, I, I literally wanted these because it's the first time having these. Oh, there's a little spoon inside. Oh, yeah. Okay. Put yeah. your, put Let's your see spoon if I can down. Show it. Yeah, oh yeah, the inside. little spoonie inside uh, there. Mm. Oh, hi, this focusing wants my face, man. Ah, All right. Look there, it has a. Oh, a seal little seal. Like this. Come, come close to the camera. I can't see anything. Okay, okay, okay. Are you gonna open yours? Yeah, I'm gonna open. I'm waiting All for right. you to open yours. Okay. Okay. Yeah, right, I'm opening go. mine as well. Yeah, mine is open. Ooh. Okay, that's yeah. the vanilla one. Let's try it at the same time. All right. One, two, cheers. Mm. Wow. Okay, they are vanilla. Crazy. That's powerful. Come. Mm. Okay. Let's, Let's do the... Mm -hmm. Why don't you use the spoon? Ah. Mmm. Mmm. That is mm. so nice. Mmm. Now, I already brought our own oh spoon. Oh my God, so it has, it has um, the chocolate inside. Your Belgian chocolate is something else. I remember when I was still in high school, I worked for a Belgian chocolate truffle place. Mwah. Which one do you like more? This one or that one? I like both. We're going to mix. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Come on, choose one. Which one do you like? This one or this one? I'm sorry, I have like to the say chocolate the, or the vanilla. The vanilla is classic. It's, it's uh, I don't know. There's this, there's this. Vanilla is always a good one, right? Mm -mm. There's this one. Mm -mm. Something I, else. I'm going to try I like something else. But this mm. one was nice. They can't make me choose. They're both nice. They're <laughs> really both nice. I don't know. Okay, You've tasted put the put flavors. Them back in the freezer, the freezer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, please. Because you saw they were starting to melt because it's so hot. Uh, we spent so long just moving about the mall and stuff like that. Yeah, that's it. And that's it. <laughs> let me know if you are a fan of Hachen Das and let me know your favorite flavor in the comments down below. This is the total the grand total for everything that we bought for this grocery haul thank you so much for watching like comment and subscribe and do the things we're on the road to 2000 subscribers so shout out to everybody that's been supporting i feel the love bye